if you think of an athlete, you see an athlete, a 100 meter runner, picture themselves running faster than everyone else, don't they? An athlete works on his own mindset. Here, you and he together have to be in agreement with what's going on. Yeah. yeah? So what we have to try and do is keep him confident in his own ability. He must believe that he can do what you're telling him to do. And while we do that, Anna, we've got to try and make him believe that you know what you're talking about. <laughs> Every time you signal to him or communicate with him, that's how you talk to him, isn't it? Yes. So he's got a belief you mean what you say, okay? But he should be doing what you tell him. That's a lovely trot to get straight for the centre. Uh, 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 keep trotting, keep trotting, keep trotting, keep trotting. And candle on, okay. So you know you've got plenty of jump to spare. We've just done some colour. He knows it's not going to bite him. So, and canter, go. Go, 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 gallop, gallop, gallop. But did you feel you actually went before him? Luckily for you, he did come with you. You said, I'm going to want to come with me, but I'll make it difficult for you to do so by sitting on your head. Don't sit on his head. Now come in canter. Now keep that canter crisp. Make sure his head and neck are straight out in front of him. Look where you're going. Canter on and gallop. Good man. That's near a rain back than gallop. So by now, he should be beginning to believe her. You see? Okay. This is the point. He should be beginning to believe her. And canter. Candle on. Candle on. Candle on. Gallop. Yes. Good away. Good away.